Hi guys, welcome to another video by Optionables. My name is Saket. In this video, we are going to make an announcement as well as we are going to review the trades taken on 14th of October as well. So today was expiry day and we made a profit of close to 4.6 lakh and we are going to review that later before which I am actually going to tell you something really important. So initially we started YouTube to spread financial literacy. In this journey, we started sharing lot of option trading strategies and then we realized that just sharing strategies is not going to help people in any way. So that's the reason we started doing live trades. And later we also realized that it is much better to give content in the regional language so it will be reaching out to people much better. Hence we started optionables in regional language. So we got a lot of feedback where people told show us how to do this with a smaller capital right so that's the reason and the one more thing is there is no point in just giving you the calls and asking you to do something if i am actually not doing the same thing so these two are the major issues so me randomly giving you a call is not going to make any sense or me doing this trades with a huge capital is also not going to make any sense so that's the reason we decided that we'll be actually trading with a smaller capital size somewhere around 25 to 30 lakh and you guys can also follow this on virtual trade right so what we will be doing is every weekend i am going to come either saturday or sunday and share a market view say something like okay the market is looking bullish and if the market is going to open up then i am going to create a bull call spread right so along with this i will also be recommending the capital per lot so if you want to do it one single lot how much capital is required or if you want to do it five lots how much capital is required so we will be deploying a real capital and the advantage of this is you will actually be trading with us maybe in virtual trade so you will be actually trading with us right so whatever trades we take we will be updating that on the telegram channel saying that today we took this particular trade right that day evening let's say monday i take a particular trade that day evening monday evening i am going to make a video where we are going to review our position all of us are going to be on the same boat because all of us have the same position open right so monday we are going to review that particular position and see if any adjustment is required so if any adjustment is required i am going to tell that in monday evening and i will execute that tuesday morning so again all of us can execute it together and all of us will still remain to be on the same boat so this way we will all be trading together and growing together as a community for this purpose we'll be using a smaller fund so it will be more relatable right so this is the initiative which we have planned out but i want one support from you guys that we want to improve this more and more and we want to reach out to more number of people i want you guys to give your suggestion in the comment section on how we can make it much better and grow together and then i also want you to share this video with as many people as possible because it will also be reaching out to more number of people and this initiative will be started from this particular sunday that is 17th of october 2021 and on 18th of october we'll be taking the first position so this is not any kind of course or anything so this is something which you will be trading real time and learning so i hope that you guys like this initiative so now we'll be quickly moving on to the trade review where i'll be showing you how we manage today's big up move and today we ended up making somewhere close to 4.6 lakh and we are going to review that in detail so thank you so much for joining guys if you are liking the content on this channel then don't forget to hit the like button share this video as well as subscribe to our channel thank you so much hi guys welcome to the live trade review and today was an unbelievable session in Bank Nifty because during the last hour, we saw a move close to 600 points. Bank Nifty shot up from 38,800 all the way till 39,340. So during the beginning of the session, the morning session, Bank Nifty actually consolidated within a very short range. So it was just a range of close to 100 points. 
and later we got a huge breakout in bank nifty where the markets rallied somewhere close to 500 points right so believe it or not we had a 38 800 short straddle so morning what we did is as soon as the market opened we actually booked our short strangle if you remember from the previous video we had a short strangle open and we actually booked that short strangle with a profit of 1 lakh and we had this particular short straddle open so what i had done to this short straddle was i had hedged it at 39000 as well as 38 600 so let me just clear the drawings so that i can show it to you much better morning we actually booked our short strangle in bank nifty with a profit of 1 lakh post that we had done a 38 800 short straddle right over here we had hedged it with 39000 as well as 38 600 so these were the entries which we had so the market was consolidating and finally around 2 o'clock we started to see a huge up move so here what i had done was i had collected close to 100 and 100 rupees in both of these legs both 800 c and p i had collected approximately 100 rupees and for this i had paid close to 40 as well as 40 rupees so for 39000 c i had paid 40 rupees for this i had paid 40 rupees so Overall, we had gone 3000 quantity, right? So now the thing is, I'm just going to plot this on Sensible and show you where the break even came and how we started adjusting this position later on. So this is how our break even actually looked like, right? So here I have just put one lot. So we had somewhere close to 3000 quantity, which means it was close to 120 lots. So let me just uh, change that quickly, right? So we had a maximum profit of close to 3.6 lakhs and a maximum loss of close to 2.4 lakh. And finally, after two o'clock, when the market actually broke this level of 39,000 and started going up. So the thing is, uh, right now I have opened the multi-strike OI as well. And you can see once Bank Nifty started to shoot up around this time, when bank nifty hit 39000 we started to see a lot of unwinding happening in 39000 calls so this had the highest number of open interest close to 45 lakh right and then as the market started to shoot up you saw a huge unwinding and by this moment when bank nifty was at 39200 you already knew that bank nifty is now no longer going to fall below 39,000 because there was huge amount of unwinding close to 30 lakh contracts of unwinding of calls whereas people added close to 40 lakh contracts of put around 30 40 lakh contracts of put so with this amount of open interest being going down on the call side and adding on the put side you don't expect market to come below 39,000 again right so what we started doing at that point, we started shorting 38,900 as well as 39,000 puts. So later, we also started shorting 39,100 as well as 39,200 puts also. So let me just uh, show that to you. So I won't be actually able to plot this on Sensible. So I'll show you what exactly will happen. Let's say I end up shorting 39,000 puts at the rate of, say, 120 lots at the rate of uh, around 35 so if i actually do this so now sensible is quite confused because 39000 puts is now much cheaper than 38800 so it won't be able to give you a proper payoff graph so rather what i'll try to do is i'll try to explain via this itself what we exactly did and how we were able to end with such a good profit right so after this trade was taken so and the market started to shoot up so the first thing what we did is we started shorting 38 900 puts so this we shorted around 30 rupees right so you can see that overall loss we have is around 2.4 lakh right so when i divide this by 3k quantity i just have to collect 80 points 80 points on 
total three K quantities so that I will never be going under a loss at all. So once I collect 80 points on three K quantity because 3000 is the quantity and the total premium I have to collect is 2.4 lakh, right? So once this is done, I will never be going under a loss. So for that, first I started with 30 rupees. Next, what I did, I shorted 39,000 PE at 40 rupees, but this I shorted 6,000 quantity, not just 3,000, 6,000 quantity. So what I have done, basically, I have already collected 80 points from this because it's 6,000 quantity plus another 30 points from this. So this has more or less taken care of all my losses. So that means now I am not going to have any losses because if I get 40 into 6k quantity, that is itself 2.4 lakh and that is going to cover my loss, right? So then this 30 into 3000 is almost 90,000 90, and that is going to be my profit. And later as the market shot up and went close to 250, I shorted 39,100 again at around 30 rupees. So again, this is 3K quantity. This is also 3K quantity. So again, that got me additional 30 points, right? And this we can actually split it into 40 as well as 40 because it's 6K quantity. And finally, I shorted 39, 200 puts at somewhere close to 30 rupees again. So again, I got one more 30 points. So not exactly 30 rupees, around the range of 30 rupees, somewhere around 35, 34, some uh, around 39 and so on, right? And last I tried doing a 39, 300 short straddle, but uh, that actually didn't work pretty well. So during the end that was, right? But overall, this is what I did. So with this, I had collected 170 points in total. So how much did I need to break even? I just wanted 80 points to break even, but I have collected 170 additional points. So that means how much do I have extra? 170 minus 80. So I have 90 points extra. So 90 into 3K is 2.7 lakh. So before that, how much did I have? I already had close to 1 lakh profit. So totally 3.7 lakh, right? So how did we actually get the remaining 1 lakh? That is because of the trade which we took in next week option. So if I just filter out expiry and put 21st October, you can see that in 21st October option, we have another 90K profit, 92K profit. So this is how we actually ended with the total M2M of 4.74 lakh. And it was pretty easy because the market was trending. All we had to do is collect some additional credits from the put side. And even though your short straddle went completely wrong, it was nothing to worry because uh, you had a lot of credits to collect from the put side and you did that and you easily ended with close to 1.2% profit, right? So we are having profits from three consecutive days and we are now, uh, we have been able to recover all our previous losses and we are now in some pretty good profits also. So let's see how this uh, entire month goes. And this will be pretty exciting to trade because uh, you really don't know what is happening to the markets. They are co continuously going up without taking a break. So let's see how we can actually enter the trades on Monday. How do we go about from there? So that's for today's trade review. And I really hope that you guys have enjoyed it. And you saw that how we managed our position during this up move. Right. So if you are liking the content on this channel, then don't forget to hit the like button and do share this video as well as subscribe to our channel. So I'll be joining you soon and Sunday I'll be coming out with one more video as to what positions we'll be taking for the 25 lakh capital. Right. Thank you so much for joining guys.